three wise men. <laughs> they walk into a cave where there's a newborn baby, an exhausted young mother, and a father who's a drained emotional wreck. <laughs> Jesus, my boy, gives us a version of the greatest story ever told, but from a slightly different perspective, that of Joseph, the very ordinary man who was a carpenter. And then they say, we have seen a star in the sky. So, it's night. <laughs> the star led us here so that we might worship this baby and bring him gifts of gold, frankincense, and myrrh. You couldn't find a rattle? Something a baby might actually like? For it is written in the stars that this baby will be king of all the Jews. As we said to Herod. Herod? You said this to Herod? Yes. <laughs> Herod, the king of the Jews, Herod? Yes! <laughs> you told the old king of the Jews that a new king of the Jews was going to be born, did you? Yes! <laughs> and you call yourselves wise men? <laughs> One of the things I love about Jesus, my boy, apart from the humor, which is fantastic, but also the fact that it's got a very strong emotional integrity to the original story. And we've helped to underscore those moments of integrity with the inclusion of harp music from Doreen Taylor Claxton, who is also a wonderful singer. <laughs> Boy was written by a playwright who was originally a stand-up comedian in England. And what's so great about that is that the humor makes this story accessible to all, whether you come from a Christian background or not. How could it be this baby in my arms sleeping now so peacefully? 